wanted to come on real quick and talk about Gloria Bambo, uh, the 20 year old black woman found hanging in her roommate's garage. Um, McKinney Police Department put out a statement on July 22nd, basically trying to um, downplay the speculation, as they say, uh, that was being spread around on social media. Uh, we know that clearly they did not do that uh, in the sense that the only thing that they provided uh, was the fact that she was uh, 20 years old and her roommate uh, who was white, was 19. Uh, they did say that the case is still open, that it's not closed. And with that being said, we expect a thorough and full in in investigation into what really and truly happened to Gloria Bam Bo. Um, also, uh, the roommate, we still do not know the roommate's name. We don't know what he looks like. We don't know uh, who he is, who he is uh, uh, tied to, associated with. We don't know if he has a criminal background. We don't know who it is, uh, this roommate who put out a letter claiming that she was found on the 12th. She had been in a garage hanging since July the 9th, and she also had bipolar uh, disorder, a mental uh, 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 problem. And all of this is based off the roommate's statement. And we're not buying it because the statement and the letter uh, uh, that was written um, is conflicting. It doesn't make sense. On the one hand, the service people are coming in and out of the house because of a leak that he states in his own letter that there was a leak in the garage and that the servicemen were coming in, in and out of the house or out of the house to remove those fans because uh, the leak area where the wall, I guess it had leaked on the wall, needed to be dried out. It is also the reason he states that his uh, parents are flying into town and that he actually picked them up from the airport. That was on July the 10th. Well, when him and his parents got home, they checked upstairs to see if Gloria Bambo was, was there because she hadn't responded since July the 9th. Um, after realizing that there was no response, um, that she was still not in the house, uh, it was alleged that he called the police. There should be a recording somewhere uh, of that fact. Nothing released by McKinney Police Department. Now is July the 12th. He comes home because, and, and, and he realized that there's an overwhelming smell uh, coming from the basement area. He checks uh, the basement and there he finds Gloria Bambo hanging. Uh, she committed suicide or had or taken her life as he states but let's back it up he then goes on to say that no one ever goes in the garage he thought not to check in the garage even though he checked everywhere in the house um, he didn't think to check the garage because uh, no one goes in the garage because the door handle was broken it doesn't make sense right it was the reason why the servicemen were coming in and out of the house, because there was a leak in the garage. It was the reason why his parents was coming into town to assist with the leak in the garage. But yet, he comes back later to say, the door handle was broken, no one usually go in the garage, so he thought not to check the garage. We're saying that it's been two weeks, three, weeks almost to a month since she went missing and almost three weeks since she was found hanging and still as of yet McKinney Police Department has not released a statement they have not released the autopsy to tell us what actually happened to her McKinney Police Department said that they believed 
that she committed suicide based off a written statement of the person that should be the first suspect. Based off his statement, it's alleged that she committed suicide. Now, now the person who actually posted uh, the message to Facebook first before we received it, her post has been removed. Uh, she's no longer on social media. Jamila Arnold, Arnold uh, the young lady who received uh, the letter from the roommate, uh, she claimed was her best friend. Her tweet or her Twitter has been removed. She no longer exists. We know that Gloria Bambo is a real person and that she was found hung in that garage because McKinney Police Department verified it. Um, there is all types of fishiness happening around this case as if those who were closely associated uh, with this roommate um, somehow disappeared. Everybody is silent. Nobody is talking. McKinney Police Department is not talking. Uh, we need to know if she's been buried. It's been a month. Um, who verified the body? When Gloria Bambo was found hanging, um, it was said that her mother was in South Africa. Did her mother ever come here and verify the body? Did they bury her? All these are answers we want answered. All these are questions we want answered. Nothing. And so we're saying that we're not going to let McKinney Police Department off the hook. We're not claiming or saying that uh, the roommate um, did anything wrong. We're not saying any of that. But what we are saying is that we want answers. If Gloria Bambo took her own life and she truly had uh, a bipolar disorder, then we'll talk about that when we know the truth. Because as of right now, we don't know the truth. And we can't take the sole statement of someone who should be the first primary suspect, we can't take his testimony as absolute truth. This is ridiculous. McKinney Police Department took this young man's statement as absolute truth before the medical examiner um, came back with their finding. They had already, after telling us to not speculate, to not put out false information, then they turn around and put out false information, speculating based off the sole testimony of the roommate that based off their investigation, though pending medical examiner finding that it appears that she may have committed suicide. Well, if you don't want us to speculate, uh, McKinney Police Department, then don't keep us in the dark about a truth and then don't come or turn right around and speculate. We want answers. We believe truth crust to the ground shall rise. We will find out the truth. It will rise to the surface. And we want you to do your job. Stay on the other end.